welcome to Life with Belsov. I'm your host, Frank Belsov. Tonight on the Belsov Show, we're still working out kinks on the old scooter rooski here. We got a limp dick right now. We got a muffler. We've already welded it twice, but she needs another weld. So we're gonna weld that up. And I'm having an issue at full throttle when it gets warm, it's bogging out. So we need to figure that out too. First of all, let's get the old welder rooski down here. Because other than that, it's working pretty good. I might end up tacking this on too because this keeps coming loose. I've, I don't know how many freaking times I've tightened that right now. I'm tired of it, Jim. So I think I might just weld her up, Captain. Have it. That way she can't move anymore. There we go. See it come loose now, you son of a bitch. So now we'll do the exhaust old pipe bowl. Careful. Is it straight? Did he even hit the pipe? No. Why would I? That time I did. Now we're just going to burn her up a little bit so she's straight. There we go. I'll give her a little kick action. Careful. What am I riding on? Ooh, hey. Ooh. Nothing like welding right beside a gas tank, Jim. Don't try this at home, kids. I wouldn't. Well, obviously, we don't have a ground there. Well, obviously, we don't have a ground there. Not much left of this pipe. I think it's gonna be pretty good right there. Nothing like a little bit of back pressure. If you all seen this pipe before you started, you'd understand why it's so hard to weld. Nothing left of it. Let's start her up. Oh, decent. put her out. Well anyways, she's solid now. So we're gonna check a few screws here and then we'll head her out and try another rip. She's still smoking. Okay, so that's still tight. That's still tight. Let's shut the welder off here. And you can jump on the handlebars here. Let's see if we can get more speed out of her. Too low. That's what's going on there. Uh oh. So the idle stuff is fucked up. Oh, big time. It's gonna need a carburetor rebuild. Well, as you can see, we definitely have a carburetor issue. So we'll get this part, we'll check it out, we'll make sure everything's flowing, we'll make sure the needle and seat's clean, and then we'll kind of go from there. But I did have a run earlier tonight and it just flew, and all of a sudden it started acting up. So, I don't know. Leave your comments down below if you know. Why wouldn't you? Ooh, sweating like a pig I am. One more try. Nope. Easy touch throttle. Boop. We'll figure it out. What the dirty old girl supplies it is. Oh yeah, figure this shit out. Holy fretter. The name stands up to it. I called her Dick and she's being a dick. Frank, what a dick. Dick. But we gotta get it ready for the weekend because we're taking her with us. So I got an extra carburetor over there and we'll fool around with it and see what's what. Get some new fuel line tomorrow because the fuel line's kind of cocked over too. So that could be that too. So we'll get the stuff we need. We'll tune her up and I'll take you for another rip when I get her running right. Who wants to see that? Leave her comments down below. Why wouldn't you? And who wants to subscribe and like? Tell me below. Why wouldn't you? But anyways, hopefully everyone's having a good night like I am. Not doing anything I ain't doing. I'm going to go in and have a nice little cool off. Sit down and then get up for work again. Doesn't that sound like fun? Yay! Freaking right it does. Have a good night. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. And you know what to do for now. Oh.